I'd like to give you a sense of um, how the course is organized and uh, offer some suggestions on how you might get the most out of it. Um, there are six sessions over two weeks. Um, new sessions will open up on Mondays and Wednesdays. And then Fridays at noon are when we have our Zoom meetings. Um, each session will have an introductory video. Uh, there will also be text and videos that contain the content um, that's covered in that session. Uh, there's a separate form to ask questions or make comments about that content. And then there's an interactive handout. Uh, the interactive handout is a, set of a series of brief statements on its single pages uh, that summarize basically what was covered uh, in, the, in the content or uh, provides food for thought. Um, and you're, you're encouraged to uh, make notes and comments and questions regarding each page of that handout. And there's a Google Doc set up for that. So you'll see that when you, when you get to that step. Um, and then there's also uh, discussion prompts for our, our group discussion. And I'm hoping that you'll not only post your own thoughts, but read everyone else's thoughts and respond to, uh, to what others say. I really hope to, to people can get to know each other in this class and that we can all learn from each other and, and, and all benefit from, from our time together. Um, there's two other forums. Uh, they're not really sessions, they're just kind of uh, forums. And uh, the first is Moments of Joy, and that's uh, available for the first week of the, in the first week of the class. Uh, this is something I used in my online class um, for over 18 years, and I just found it to be a great benefit. Uh, it was a course on stress management. And the instructions are very simple. Uh, just pay attention throughout the day and post one moment of joy uh, that you see you have during that day. Nothing spectacular, you know, I got a raise or won the lotto, nothing like that. Just something simple. Um, I saw my baby smile. Um, I smelled the fresh air outdoors. I saw this flower. Um, there was a rabbit in the front yard. Um, hopefully that's a, <laughs> not eating your flowers, but something that brought you a moment of joy and just put that in and share it. Um, what I found is that uh, it expands our, our, our frame, our thinking, opens up our emotions and perceptions and creates a shift of focus. And particularly in the, in the first two sessions uh, where we're talking about perception and understanding fear, uh, moments of joy can facilitate the, the learning in that. Uh, the other form comes up in the second week uh, is called Grateful Moments. And for that uh, part, you think of five things um, that you're grateful for. And again, not really big things, but just simple things. I'm grateful for, for my coffee. Okay, I love having my coffee in the morning. Um, I'm grateful for having a nice shirt. Uh, I'm grateful that glasses allow me to read what's on the screen. Otherwise, <laughs> I'd be lost and I wouldn't be teaching this class. Um, just things that you're grateful for. And uh, what I noticed from that is it, it tends to soften our attitude and outlook. Uh, it helps us see a larger picture and, and realize how we benefit and, from each other and need each other. Um, one other suggestion uh, is that you approach this uh, course at your own pace, um, a bit at a time. Uh, please don't think of it as one more thing you got to get done today. Um, we, were learn we learn best when we're in relaxed, reflective kind of mood. So feel free to come in and go out, uh, do a little bit. It's broken down into pieces, so you can actually, you know, get a benefit by coming in for five minutes. Uh, so I think the, the more you come in and out and the more relaxed and reflective you are when you come in, the more that, that not only you, but that we're all gain from the class because you'll be sharing things that we can all benefit from. Thank you.